Welcome to Farming Simulator 19 on console with me, Shay Fiddy. We're on Stone Valley and on this fourth episode we bought a field with withered crops. What a dead loss. Enjoy everybody. As you can see we've done quite a few contracts here. One of 47,000, one of 17,000, another of 14,000, and we've got bottom left is 45,000, and we've got another one of 40,100 dollars. Sorry for it being so small on the screen, but that's the contracts we've done, and that's helping us out. So let's get into it. Welcome to episode 4, everybody. <laughs> been doing a lot of work off screen a lot of contracts as you've seen so we're ready to harvest and to buy another field but before we go there let's look at field prices we own field 8 now I don't want to buy 7 yet due to the fact that there's cotton on there and I can't do anything with the cotton so I was thinking maybe we buy field 6 now I don't don't know oops sorry guys I don't know how the weed control stuff was in there let's see weeds okay it needs plowing no weeds so we can buy it harvest it plow this out and do soil samples and then we have a nice field so I think oh, but then we need to buy a corn and soya bean header Okay, how much is it? 113,000. We've got 395 grand at the moment. So I'm going to buy that. Then, we've got a bit of a problem. I was driving at night while I was doing a contract. And I put the cruise control of the tractor on. Now I'll show you uh, my little dilemma that I've got. I drove into the farm and my phone rang. And I looked down to answer my phone. And this is what happened. <laughs> I drove through my own field. And I accidentally messed up everything here. Yeah. Oh my great days. I've got crop destruction on as I came into the farm from that side. Drove and I wanted to stop the tractor and my cell phone rang and I just kept going straight through oh my days but it is what it is so let's harvest our first field we've pur just purchased a nice piece of field which we own now let's just move forward I know it's not the biggest harvest that you can get in game but at least we've got a harvester. Okay, let's go this way. Okay, let's just L1. Do I need to unfold this harvester? It doesn't seem like it. There's nothing. Just gonna disable the straw swath for now. Okay, I'll just pull in close. Then we'll start at the point and go through. So at least we're, we're making it where yeah. I do apologize. I've recorded a few days ago due to the fact that I'm working hard and it's it's a bit problematic. <laughs> I don't get to everything. Okay, we've got that down. Switch on the cruise control. Turn that on. Let's get harvested. This field is ready to go. Let's hope I'm catching up everything here. Yeah. I've never done this. I just want to see if I'm in the boundary. Yes, I am. So yes, it's it's been difficult doing work, gaming. It's. I surely wish I can get to the point where I can say okay. I can become a full-time gamer. Um, 
hopefully I'll hit the amount of subscribers I need and views etc to be able to do so so yes let's go through here lift that up it's cutting quite nice I'm not missing anything just want to do that I don't want to drive with a wheel through the crop of the camera angle near my camera angle let's do it like this quickly then I can talk to you guys and make sure that I catch everything for the boundary line so yes for those who have subscribed thank you very much I appreciate it um, if you haven't subscribed yet, please hit the subscribe button I'll appreciate it um, FS22 is dropping really soon extremely soon then I will be able to do more map the new maps that gets released I'm gonna do map tours of modded maps and I will also do new mods that's released I'll also do how to videos so there's a lot that I'm, I'm gonna be upgrading a few things the way I do it so yes if you want to see me do that please hit the subscribe button and the notification bell so if I release a new video you'll be notified so so yes, we're gonna push forward in that regard. We're gonna see if I can better my videos and join the rest of the crew to get much better content out there for you guys. Farm wise, I've been pushing hard. I wanna buy a tractor that's got narrows on reason being if I have to do weeding and stuff like that then I've got a tractor with narrows on I know an auger wagon is pretty important but for now we can carry on with the trailer that we've got so I'll definitely invest in an auger wagon but first I think very important there is my track there <laughs> very important I need to get on track with some equipment I will need to buy a decent size field even this one next door oh but that's a bit too big for now I might buy these three fields that we got next to each other here I just need the the cotton to be harvested so that we can buy into that I see our yield in the bottom on the minimap picking up happy days if that goes green then I'm happy we're already at 69% capacity 70 almost at 80 I'll try to make it around so that we can get the trailer in next to this I know this harvester doesn't have a huge capacity on it, but it certainly helps. I mean, we've got 280 grand. If we sell this crop, maybe we'll be able to upgrade our harvester 80%. Oh. Don't hit the pole. That's our power line there. Don't drive over the crops either. We need the money. So, yes, we've got. A new field, so we definitely need to buy it. Get that harvester harvested before it weathers out. Um, I'll pretty soon do a video on weathering and crop destruction and also beside the weeding process how to use herbicide and a weeder so yes it's, it's getting there it's a bit time consuming but we, we are certainly getting there making the efforts making things work I'll hire a worker to carry on with us while we go and sort out other things 
I haven't checked what the contracts look like for today. That's 100% don't drive over the crops. I'll have to reverse back quite a bit here yeah, to get the train index. So let's pull out the auger wagon or the auger pipe. Let's switch this unit off. Let's run over here, get our tractor, come back in here and start moving things around. I've received a few questions regarding my gameplay. Why I do things that I do? Why don't I drive in cab? Um, I just need to get used to it, I suppose. I'll, I'll do it. I'll get to it. So just now. Hmm. Pretty sure I'll start doing it on FS22 for you guys. For those who have been asking, let's switch on our beacon lights. We'll go on public roads here. No traffic. I'll, I'll start doing it pretty soon. Just need to get the hang of it. I've never done it before, so to be quite honest with you. Let's pull in there. Switch off the beacon lights. Get out there. How many liters capacity does this thing have? Let's check it out quickly. I think it's like 3000, maybe, ish. Not sure. Hmm. I know it's better to offload on the go, but I'm busy doing the headlands now. Four and a half thousand. Okay. I'm busy doing the headlands so that we can get cracking with that. Put the auger pipe back in. Let's get cracking again. Switch that on. Let's get the head in there and start doing some work here. Hopefully soon we'll be able to afford a harvester with a much bigger head on it. I'm looking to go case high, so I'll just see what's worth my wall. For now, we'll have to stick around with this unit. I don't want to buy a corn sunflower header as yet, because we don't know after selling this crop how much we'll get for the canola on this field, depending on our yield. If the yield keeps going where it is, it seems like we're in a different swell top now because it keeps on fluctuating. We'll have to see. I surely want to play 99.9% .9 of my map plays on or let's plays on FS22 with seasons enabled. Just to kick it up a notch. I know a lot of people are saying, yes, but why do you want to do that? And <sighs> So many questions, but we have to start somewhere. I wonder if I put a work on this, if you'll be able to turn around on this small headland here. Let's see. I'm going to drive with a driver for now with Ash, he's busy operating the combine at the moment, so let's see how far we get while that's happening we're going to be checking prices quickly see the yield is fluctuating it's up and down, but we should make a decent profit out of this what's our canola price at the moment? If we look at our prices, something's biting me for some reason. 1,402 at West Cell Point, which is not a bad price. Let's mark that. Just want to see if this unit's going to turn around on his own close to the farm. 
then we'll surely check while that's been while that's happening harvesters I want to go to the modded versions first got a lot of John Deere's I think it's because of the packs I've downloaded then we've got the actual flow that holds 14,400 compared to the echo <sighs> Can the hopper be upgraded? Nope. I wonder before we buy. I don't have a, a case modded version yet. It's only JDs. Okay, let's go check the headers. Maybe we can get an idea. Hmm. I think we need to get a drape. You can see I love playing with JDs though. It's 100 grand basically for the lizard that I can customize into a case I age it is a 13.7 that's only a 12.5 so I think I'm gonna customize that one the draper is much better I can tow it to where I need it then it can do most of the basic crop so before I buy something I'll go and check the modded versions what it is we're looking at or what models we're looking at so the harvester we might only be upgrading in the next episode as soon as we do the other field we'll see how it goes oh my greatness we still need to buy a silo for the film it's one thing after the next because we will need a proper silo I'll just check what silos are available and what prices we're looking at the silos are quite expensive this is going to take forever and a day let's check our silos out quickly I love the wooden silo I think it holds 10 million each crop. I just love the silo. Uh, I've got so many mods installed. Sorry, guys. Fast crop. Oh, there it is. It was 10 million for 30 grand. It's well worth it. I think we're going to put it on a farm. I would have loved to put it there, but then the turnaround of this unit that will certainly have an impact there as you can see we've got these three here but I don't have a physical silo on the farm I don't know why uh, this is a load area oh my greatness can't even put it here collide with an object <sighs> You maybe place it here out of the way collides with an object oh my great days wait why don't we put it in here it's still on our farm it's in our driveway it will make it easier to offload and load yeah I think I'm gonna place it right here I love that idea so we just bought ourselves a silo while the tractor is added. Oh my greatness. Hmm. Any one percent. Let's jump out and go fetch a tractor. Hopefully he will make another run. And on the way down we can offload him quickly. Then I'll go do a bit of landscaping on our new silo. Such a pity because I'm pretty sure we had a silo on the other. I don't know what happened to it. <laughs> to be honest with you. Don't know what these are for. Maybe they, they're just decorative items. I don't know. So we'll be upgrading, upgrading as far as we can. Okay, start this unit up. Turn it straight off the bat. Let's go there. 
Oh, don't drive over the crops, please. I surely need to also... What we can do is we can check... I'm almost certain this tractor we can't put narrows on it. I haven't checked though. Okay, I need to drop the cruise control down from 52 to 10 k's an hour. Yes, the harvester can turn around. It's going to take a while for that thing to harvest. In the meantime, we can so long fix up the field. I'll then quickly go out, go check out the new, well not the new, check for a case our age mod version of our harvester. Come back in because clearly I haven't downloaded anything on case I age because I normally play with John Deere. But I can't be biased, we'll just fix it. Download a mod. modded version see what we can get from the mod up as soon as we're done here yeah, maybe in the next episode we'll be able to afford one to check what to do get one this is not too bad but it's not the best harvest in the world I understand that just gonna cruise with it just to offload it quickly okay, it seems like it's empty so I'm going to pull this away, drive through the neighbor's crops. Okay, while we're waiting for him, let's switch this unit off. Let's go to landscaping. I want to landscape this part. Let's make it square. Why can't I sculpt here? Oh, this is so bad. Can't do anything, so... <laughs> that will have to stay like that I suppose yeah wait a second that's why sorry guys it was me what color matches Yep, that's it. I'll just have to fix up the little bit that I went over there. Okay, so let's do that bit. Send so the camera. I'll just fix up that bit there with a bit of fake grass. <laughs> Put a bit of fakeish grass in there. Oh, this camera angles. I don't know what's wrong with me today, but... Okay, so let's see. Let's make that a bit smaller. Let's see what potential nice grass we've got here. Does that look fakeish? No, it actually looks... Not too bad. Alright. Oh my greatness. Okay, we'll have like a line around the where we at now. Come on, Shafer D. Do I really want to go in that much with grass? No, I don't. Don't let me you know what. Let's just put grass like that and I'll fix that up quickly. I'll sculpt it. That doesn't look too bad at all. It's matching. Yes, there we go. Fixed up. Not too bad for a sculptor. So at least we've got a nice silo here now with grass around it, not the best deal, but it's worth it. Let's punch over there and see what's happening over here. Oh 
I just hope this unit will go like that forever and not miss a spot. That will be so nice. Let's jump over here yeah, with Ash and C. He's at 34% now. There we go, he's catching everything. I would certainly love to get, if we look at a corn slash sunflower header, oh, me and John Deere mods, I love this header though, 12 meter, I'll buy this one, the normal 12 meter, due to the fact that Okay, it's 90 grand. It's the same as the others. It's a 12 meter. It's red. It's nice. I'll buy that. This is a 6 meter. I don't want too small. This is the one that we can get for the current harvester we're running. I don't think this will f these will fit on Novas. That's more for the Activias and those kind of combines. So the Nova 330 is what we've got at the moment, but I'm not going to spend 19 grand now. Maybe we should just to get the corn in to get that sold as well. What's the corn prices like at the moment? If we look at the corn prices, we're at 810 bucks per thousand liter, which is not bad. At North Cell Point, it's still climbing. We'll get there. I also need to, before I forget, how much is the biogas plant? If it's, wait, I think I'm going to purchase it now. 23 grand, we can buy it, we can afford it now. Let's buy it. Okay, we own the biogas plant as well. So now, let's look at our prices. So, if you look at there's our biogas plant so we've got additional selling points now for that we've got rye we've got all those things i'll try my best to get through to everything as we can i mean this is gonna take a while then i still need to look at if i sell I'm just going to look at the base price now. If I have to sell this unit, we'll get 77,000 for it. That's another 23. So you can say we're looking at 100,000. So we're sitting on 326,000 roughly. I'm just estimating now. Then we need to look at a combine. Then we need to get a normal crop header and we need to get a sunflower and corn header as well so it's two headers you can say it's a roughly 200,000 for the two headers then comes the combine so you see where the dilemma is now it's more than just okay let's buy it's a lot of planning behind it as well financial planning need to be very careful not to upgrade too quick but you can't sit on I mean like this that we're using now it takes forever to harvest due to the size of it we'll get there okay, I'm gonna jump out here quickly due to the fact that I need to get our tractor because our Combine is already at 80% capacity. Start this unit up. Let's pull in. I think we should be able to get roughly, hopefully, per. I'll say 10, 20, 30,000, 40,000 liters of this field. Then we've got that field over there at the back, but that's corn. So I might 
by the coordinator for this harvest to get this harvest that side sell all the crop then see if we've got enough for a combine I would surely love to get myself a secondary tractor with narrows on I think once we've emptied this unit out quickly we'll go and see if we can customize this current tractor with two narrows for the time being if we can save money why not why purchase a new tractor if we've got a tractor that we can just chuck narrows on so this unit should be empty now, yes. Okay, quickly gonna Oh I've pushed the combine over a bit. Oh my great days. Let's see quickly if I pushed him over too much to the point where or is he gonna rectify the situation here? Yeah. Yes he's rectifying. Sorry for that, Ash. But also, Ash never 330 at it. It's not doing too bad. Maybe this will be a great thumbnail, though. Let's switch that off, take that out of the way. Then I'll stand here as soon as it gets close. Boom. There's one. There's another one. <laughs> Let's switch that back on. For you guys that asked me the last time to leave it on, I will do so. I'll have to plan my work here so carefully. I actually need to see because I've got periodic plowing switched on. I've got lining switched on, I've got so much of the options on at the moment. Okay, let's pull into our workshop here. Oh, there's something that I figured out that I want to show you guys quick. Switch that unit off. Let's see what customizing we can do on this. Let's repair it as well while we're at the workshop. Okay, rear twin wheels. Whoa narrow twin wheels is that narrows? What? that's a standard crawler track oh my great days rear twin wheel I think will this whoa I would love the extra horsepower that takes it up to 435, we were at 409, we can surely use that little bump there. Will this narrows work in a field without damaging a crop? I think, now I want to test it. Let's customize it. That was another 13 grand down the tubes now. But if it won't damage our crops, then we don't need to buy a secondary tractor. We save the money. I'm just going to use that part where I drove through accidentally. I just want to get the front wheels in there. Okay, it seems like it's not... Okay, yikes. We saved all that money for these narrows. It looked a bit too big to be of a narrow kind, but we've got narrows on people. We saved so much money now. What a good day. I see our neighbors here. They found me really strange here. I haven't seen a farmer attend to this field next to us here, field 7. We have field 8 and field 6. I would love to buy 7, but I don't have a cotton harvester, so it's pointless for me to buy that field now. At the moment in time, it's really pointless, because I don't 
ever harvest to take that crop out of the field. And for me to buy that, it's going to be such a waste of crop. I wonder if there's a contract in that field. So I know there's huge money contracts, 50,000, 40,000 plus. But I don't want to come in now and do things that I will regret later. I mean, oh, call it hearing me. I just emptied that out to make sure that we're on track. Okay, we're good to go. Put back the worker part, please. Thank you, sir. Why is my lights on? I'm so glad we got these narrows. How tractors surely use needs a wash. I'll buy a pressure washer. The funding is not quite there for a full on wash bay. Oh my pressure washer. So this is going tremendously slow <laughs> with this header that we I mean this header, I think it's a three or a six, oh it's a five. It's going tremendously slow. We don't have any repairs on any of our other vehicles at the moment. Uh, and then I need to upgrade that going forward. This is our cultivator, yes. Let's quickly have a look at what contracts we've got. Let me go rush over to this side. I don't owe any money. Oh, I was there. Cultivating. Is there anything on field 7? For harvesting. So if I can harvest it for our neighbor. What? <sighs> you see now, guys. This is becoming a problem. I might take on this contract and borrow the items. I wonder if I must take on this contract for eight grand, get that harvested, sell the bales for him. make a bit of money and potentially buy that field you know what no i'm gonna back out of this one i'll do that contract later I'm, I'm gonna back out of that one i'm not gonna do it now there's much bigger contracts that can help me now uh, let's have a look 19k cultivating i can't use the tractor now harvesting 15 27 sowing No, 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 no. JFD, don't go there, please. Not now. I'm busy on my farm. What is this filled with? 121. No. No. JFD, no. We first need to buy a harvester. Can't go there now. I'm not buying another field. Okay. Our own fields. Let's check here. Okay, he's cracking on there. Weeds. None as yet. Six needs plowing. And if we look at it, it looks like sunflowers. Let's run over there and check it out quickly. Oh, there's a lot of weeds in between here. Yo. That is a load of weeds. That should have been clear. Nice and clean. It's not. This field is quite big. Even if I must add. Or say so myself. It's quite huge. Oh. This is withered out. Oh. There's no money coming in here. <laughs> so we might as well get on the plow. <laughs> it's with it out. We're losing that money on that sunflowers. Okay, that means I don't have to buy it. 
So at the moment, canola is paying the best for what we can do as a normal crop. So I'm going to replant that field canola and our new field canola. Harvest that out, get that going, make money out of that. I quickly want to offload that harvester. Because I'm going to take this tractor quickly, put the plow on it, plow out our new field. Is it missing here? Wait. Get that field plowed out so we can plant both of these fields. <sighs> Make money out of it, don't miss there, please. Okay, it's not missing. Once we get that going, then we'll have two fields as income and we'll take it from there. I mean, every penny that we can make is a step closer to better equipment, better everything. So I'm gonna detach this here quickly. So we're gonna leave it here on the field. Touch it nice and easy. Okay, let's go get our plow quickly. Shove this tractor in there. We'll be bouncing between our tractor and our harvester just to see that things run smoothly. I think, I almost think, where did we leave our plow? Should be in here. Yes, there it is. We'll plow it out, do swell samples. After swell samples, we will crack on with the rest again. Okay, switch on our beacons. Come now, beacons. Before we make an accident on this road, we don't want that. See, this can, or this field here, yeah, it's quite large. Would love to have that field, but we can't afford it at this moment. Unless I buy it. Just wanna see something quickly. What does the state of it look like? Ready to harvest. Oh my greatness. It's really pulling me. It's really. <laughs> it's just doing my head in. Because I really wanna want that field. I need all three of these fields to make a proper income. But I need to buy a new harvester. What to do? What to do? Okay, let's unfold that. I need to get this plowed out very quickly because our harvester is gonna run full and our tractor is all over the place. Plow, plow, plow. Wait, let's lift up the bombs here so we can go full throttle. That's it. Now we're talking. Now we're getting somewhere. I mean, if this can run. This field is quite large. It's not a small field. But I would love to own all three fields on different crops. I'm not going to merge it into one field yet. Um, I'll think about it going forward, but not for now. I'm happy with things as it is. I'm hiring a worker quickly to get this done. I just need to keep a solid eye on our harvester, what's happening there. As soon as a combine needs a certain level of capacity, then I'll have to pull out here quickly, rush there, take the trailer fill up everything again it's a pity that this withered up I was supposed to check it before I buy it but beggars can't be choosers we own this now it's our field let's plant and get cropping here every penny we can make now we're gonna push make money that's what farming is about, so we need to do it. 
pretty sure this is going to stop before the end of the field due to the collisions, yes. So I'll do this part this little bit manually. Lift that up. I'm going to do another row, then I can unleash this and let the worker carry on with it. I'm hiring a normal worker from town. I've got on-hand workers to help out, should I need to do so. Wink, wink. The combine is really getting to a certain level and I need to sell those crops and make sure we've got what it takes to make everything happen hopefully we can now if we look at the plowing screen that's the plow going on there so we still need to do soil samples in this field then apply lime and plant while we're planting it adds the fertilizer so our nitrogen everything our nitrogen and ph will be correct for the next crop top let's have a look at our recording time quickly we've still got like another 10 minutes left then we'll settle this episode and we'll carry on in the next one in the meantime i'll go to the mod up and see what mods there is for the case rh combines and we'll take it from there all about for me it's all about the horsepower and the amount of bushels it can hold the amount of liter capacity to me that's very important because the more liters the better let's switch off the beacons here for a second okay now i'm gonna let this worker carry on the run through the field to get this plowed out if we look at the plow screen it's really getting there, but it's still a big field to plow up. I'm pretty sure our combine is hitting it at the back. If we look at our plow from an in cap view. Can't believe this weathered out. I nearly bought a header. I nearly made a big mistake. Do you think I know I saw it running? Uh, Russell Mac, uh, I hope so. Yeah, this cotton field. If I look at all the weeds in there, that is a lot. I haven't seen that the combine shows it's 80% or anything yet. We'll check. If it well then it will shoot it just now at least we're making it on this plowing this out I just want to see if it's is that unit still moving are you kidding me right now looks like oh no that's 80% capacity right there. That's our trailer. That's our combine. So we might have to rush there quickly and empty it out. Okay, so let's. I'm gonna put the plow neatly on the side of the field. Lower that down. Okay. Let's rush over there quickly, get our trailer in there while it's heading towards us, we can empty it out quick. Let's switch on the beacons, go out on the road, get the trailer, offload that, come back, get the plow going. See it's a, a back and forward thing here, yeah. jumping back and forth, but what can we do? Whoever said farming is easy, it ain't. It's a difficult game, but 
in real life it's a bit difficult but it's I think it's the best job in the world. Oh, there's most of that here with the combine I see. Because of the collisions. Where is our combine? Oh, it's already heading back this way. So we'll quickly try to make a shop, no, I'm not going to make it. I'll have to go into the road, turn around, switch on our beacons, can't see traffic here. Sorry neighbor. I'll collect that little bit over there as soon as the combine's finished with the fuel. Oh, did I just hook that? Oh my golly days. You know what, now I might as well finish this up quickly. Switch that off. Sorry Ash. Let's get this offloaded quick. The auger pump is a bit low. Get this one offloaded, pick up that little bit there, at the back there we don't have an issue. Come offload, not offload now. There we go, while it's offloading I'm getting myself ready to pick up that little bit there I mean every cent we can make let's pick this up quick just like that okay. I'm going to overshoot with the combine a bit now, I'll have to go past our trailer, turn around, come back in. It's not the end of the world. I'm going to come a bit to the left, because I see... How did I miss that little bit there now? No, Shafety. No, no, no. Take that off the ends here. There we go. That's much better. Sorry guys. I'm a perfectionist. What can I say? I love things the right way. Okay, let's try it. Tempt 56. I drive into the field now. I'm going to overshoot a bit to the left. Just to ensure that we pick up everything that we had to. Okay, jump out. Let's start the engine up here. Okay, so we've got 22,975 so far. I'm going to detach this here. Go hook up to our plow. Let Ash carry on there. And we'll hook up to the plow again and get our field plowed up. Field 6. I'll save up money to buy this. First things first, I need to get us a combine first, a much better combine. The quicker we can combine, the quicker we can get two other work on the farm I mean it's already like 5 past 11 in the morning and we're still busy harvesting a field let's get that reversed in perfect pickup I'm just glad we put narrows on here. Yes, I know it has an effect on our tractor, but I mean, it's a bit better than buying 
a new tractor just to have a tractor with narrows on the farm so I think that's going to be that for this episode if you've liked the information that I've shared with you useful please do give the video a thumbs up hit the like button if you want to leave a comment please be my guest if you want to share this video please feel free to do so please guys don't forget to hit the subscribe button I will really appreciate it it will help me going forward with the farming video so you'll also be notified if I release a new video or upload a new video if you hit the subscribe and click on the notification bell I'd really appreciate the subscribers to help me going forward. So, until the next one, thanks for watching everybody. Enjoy.